instructions for playing this game. Now, yeah, now not only are the, the ways to do things here, but also there's rules for what you don't want to do, right? Now, uh, we know a lot of places where we can find rules, don't we? Do we have rules at school? Huh? Yeah, I'll tell you what, this Bible here is full of rules. Where do you think we can find more rules? The rule book for the National Football League or the Bible? You think the Bible? Well, the Bible has about 600 rules. How many rules are in the NFL? Anybody know? Maybe a thousand different ones? A thousand one, I figure, yeah. <laughs> but rules are good, right? Your mom have rules in the for the kitchen, Sarah? Yes. Yeah? And guess what? If we all drove our cars and we didn't know the rules of the road, somebody might get hurt, right? You, you, there's rules for riding bicycles, you know? Did you know that? Yeah, I was too. Car wrecks are no fun. Have you ever been in one, JJ? No, I haven't either. Lately. But I have been. Well, the good news is, there is one rule in all of this book of rules. I, this probably wouldn't happen for uh, being a driver or being a football player on the, uh, on the highway. But for the rule of life from the Bible, this is what the Apostle Paul tells us is the most important. He says, owe no one anything except to love one another. For the one who loves another or loves your neighbor, has fulfilled the law. Isn't that great? When we love our neighbor, it covers everything else. Every other rule that can be put together, all the Ten Commandments and everything, is all taken care of when we love our neighbor. Now, do we have warm, fuzzy feelings for everybody, Zoe? Huh? Yeah. You do? That's great. But someday you might not. But I got good news for you. Loving another doesn't always mean having warm, fuzzy feelings for them. But do you know what the Bible means when it says to love one another? Do you know what it means? Huh? Come close and I'm going to tell you. Come here, everybody. I don't want to give the answer away to them because I'm going to tell them to come here. You want to know what it is? Huh? Get that? Remember that? Yeah. Let's pray and ask the Lord to help help us to be loving when we need to be, all right? Lord Jesus, we just pray that as neighbors surround us and as we seek to be uh, friends to all that we can be, we pray, Lord, that you will put, us, put in our hearts to love everybody as your Savior Jesus loved us. We thank you for loving us first, Lord. Pray that you help us love others. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, you'll have to talk to your teacher, okay? All right. Thanks so much. <laughs>